what would the split be like when you're looking at uh, traditional energy sources versus renewables or green energy? The renewables have been steadily going up uh, as a portion of uh, planned and committed investments in the region up to close to 25% of the total. Uh, and, and this is, uh, as I said, um, uh, a reflection of the emphasis that the region is putting on the energy transition. We have seen also uh, an emphasis on green financing. Uh, by green financing, I mean um, going to the market and issuing green bonds that uh, proceeds of which will be used uh, for uh, uh, green financing um, in, in the region that uh, uh, further uh, strengthen the uh, transition uh, uh, itself. So, uh, however, uh, as I always say, the, the last barrel of oil will always be from this region. That means that the hydrocarbon uh, and the fossil fuel investments will continue uh, in this region to be a key driver for, for growth. Uh, however, the focus should be on the cleaner and low cost uh, hydrocarbon uh, investments. Ahmed, just before we let you go, within that report, I mean, you talked about the last barrel of oil. I mean, what are we talking about in terms of um, the ceiling, if you will, um, when you think about this with regards to last barrel of oil, peak oil? Where do you project that to be? I think in the next five years, uh, oil uh, oil demand, uh, uh, or let me put it this way, the, 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 the next uh, five years should present an opportunity for the MENA region in particular to have a bigger market share uh, in the oil uh, in the oil market, uh, and if if the investments that we talk about uh, uh, in the report happen, uh, this opportunity will be much uh, stronger. I think the oil demand in the next uh, couple of years uh, will will range between um, uh, uh, five to six uh, uh, million uh, barrel a, a day from the region, and also um, the oil the oil prices will. Uh, uh, I think balance around 50 to 60 dollars uh, per barrel, uh, however, with some uh, volatility.